Welcome to my channel, Main Street Orlando. My name is Josie, and today we are back here at Disney Springs to check out all the latest Disney merch. Let's go. Came inside the world of Disney, and look what we spotted, a new Big Feet plush. If you watch my channel, you know I love Monsters, Inc. Let's check it out. It is the Boo from Monsters, Inc. Big Feet plush, and she is adorable. She's wearing her little monster outfit. Look how adorable she looks, the little monster eyes. It is $35, and it's a Big Feet plush, because, you know, they have big feet. And you turn it around, this is adorable. The monster. Monsters, I was gonna say Monsters U. Monsters Inc. Big Feet Plush Collection is growing because they also have a, I was gonna Sully. say Mike Wazowski. I'm getting all mixed up today. A Sully, a Sully plush. Maybe we need Mike Wazowski. But instead of Mike Wazowski, what they have is Mike Wazowski's teddy bear. And I have this one at home. Today is our lucky day because we have spotted the new Nuimos plush. It is Russell from the movie Up, and he is a precious wilderness explorer. I love it. Look at him with his patches here, his little wilderness explorer outfit. You can actually take it out. Okay, okay. He has a little hat, which I think if you cut these like little plastic things you can probably remove the hat i'm not it looks like yeah, you can it. it's so cute his wilderness explorer hat oh he is 22 dollars let me know if you love russell if you take out the shirt on top or the collared shirt look they have a wilderness explorer undershirt never got the chance to show these or even look at them i remember at the end of last year everyone was wearing these and i was like where is that from apparently it was from here in walt disney world and it seems to be a restock of the baymax munchling s'more it is the plush ears it is so so cute look a little drip chocolate and they're 35 dollars A new tumbler for Walt Disney World. You remember the little tie-dye collection they have going on? Well, here's the tumbler. And this one here is $25. And just to kind of give you a little refresher, you know, they had the sweatshirt, the spirit jersey bucket hat. And there seems to be a growing amount of Walt Disney World logo merchandise like this. It's pretty basic, but you know, it represents even the backpack here for $55, which is a good park bag. And look, they even have spirit jersey bucket hats that match the collection at $40. More for up, it's grape soda. Okay, grape soda, little tumbler here. Is that what you call this, a tumbler? Adventure is out there with the little balloons. This is so adorable, little silicone straw. It looks kind of like those mason jars, right? But it's plastic, of course and it's 25. Mr. Emil is here with us today. Welcome back, guys. And look at my shirt today. This shirt is from Guardians of the Galaxy. Star-Lord. Star from Volume three. 3. Volume 3. You guys know, big Guardians of the Galaxy fan. And anyhow, we are back here at Disney Springs. We're not going to the parks. No, no parks today. No, not, for today. not for today. The parks are very full. It is spring break season, so more than expected, right? More than expected. But gladly we were able to find some merchandise here at the World of Disney and stay tuned because we will go around the stores here at Disney Springs, things you could probably not find over at the parks. Yeah. But Mr. Emil, you're in the mood. For treats. A sweet treat. Let's go check it out. Here it is, Salt and Straw, the ice cream shop. They have limited edition flavor, says now scooping the cereal sly, right? Cereal, cereal no, sly. cereal sleep. Like seriously, oh, you get it, Mr. Emil? Yeah. Delicious series. They got pots of gold and rainbows. 
peanut butter brownie cereal puffs, corn flake cookies with Marion Berry jam, which is what we're gonna get. Cereal milk, ice cream, corn flake cookies, and Marion Berry jam. Or the vegan of off limits zombie with coconut and pandan. Look at how cute the illustration for the limited edition flavors are. The seriously delicious series. Luckily, in Salt and Straw, you can try the flavors before you make a decision. And we couldn't decide between the pots of gold and rainbows and the cornflakes. The pots of gold of ra and rainbows, pots of gold and rainbows was so good was so good so we had to get double scoop we had to get both okay so pots of gold and rainbows yeah that one is basically um basically lucky charms, um, lucky charms. Lucky yeah charms. like you're yeah, eating yeah. lucky charms hold on mm. my childhood my childhood it's a lucky charm cereal it's really good it's good you can see the pieces of the Lucky Charms. Can you see that? Okay, so now we've made it to the one with Sick the jam. Season. I'm gonna show just like, it has so much jam in it. And then it has kind of like these like hardened or like frozen cornflakes, right? Like look at the amount of jam that it just has. You it's can, really good. Yeah, you can feel the, the cornflakes. The cornflakes, like really, you, like hardened cornflakes. I give you like. You really feel the, the, the jam. Mm. Mm -hmm. Like I said, you can try the flavors before you commit. And there's so many flavors, and some of them it's like questionable. So it's good to try them prior to committing. And, and monthly they have different flavors. They, monthly, usually monthly they have different flavors, which is fun. And we tried the peanut butter brownie, brownie one. It was really good, but we ended up choosing the other two. It tastes, Mr. Emil tasted a lot of the peanut butter. I tasted more of the brownie. But the, their ice cream definitely does have like lots of textures. Yeah. yeah. Almost forgot. Mr. Emil is going to give us the rating. So pots of golden rainbows, one to ten. Ten. A ten. What about the, the cornflakes one? A nine. A nine. There is a beautiful Disney collaboration here at the Tommy Bahama store. Let's check it out. They have a collection with Minnie and Mickey Mouse on vacation and it seems like they are on vacation to Italy. Do you see that postcard there? Postcard or photograph more photograph. Like. Yeah, photograph. Look at them biking. That is so pretty and there she is painting Minnie Mouse. So graceful. The button down here is $158 and Mr. ML, show them the corksicle. They have a stemless corksicle and there they are. Those are the photographs. I'm gonna zoom in of Minnie Mouse painting. What else we got? Look at them having a, doing a car ride on the boat in Venice, right? And then having some coffee and some treats, some afternoon coffee, how beautiful. And this corksicle here is, hold on, $74 because it is a set of two. And this button down shirt, it is nice and soft and airy. Anyhow, it is the embroidered Mickey Mouse on the bike in the background seaside hotel and says, let's take the scenic route and buon viaggio. Probably said that wrong. Probably said that wrong. Angela, please let us know how you say that. My favorite part is the front side because Mickey is holding a camera. The price of this, $178. They have the t-shirts on the mannequins. That's the first one we just showed you. Look how precious that looks. And look at this t-shirt with Minnie Mouse. I just realized even the shorts have Minnie and Mickey. This one here is very cute too. It has, you know, Minnie and Mickey, the camera, having some coffee, but wait. Also our beloved Pluto. These polo shirts are $128. Embroidered on there is Mickey golfing with his golfing shoes and everything and then look at the little like details the prints that you can find on the inside so the print on the shorts is called maple's postcard to paradise the shorts are 128 dollars 
Okay, those were the men's shorts. These are the women's shorts in like kind of like a linen material. It is 128. Found a t-shirt for $110 and it has some sequins on it and embroidery. This is the women's button down and it is so precious and it looks very fresh, you know, for a hot summer day. And it is $178. It's called Coastal Cruising Shirt. Look how beautiful her eyelashes. Even the backside has a beautiful print. Found a fanny pack and it says here, 5% of profits go to Hawaii conservation organizations. This is the Aloha collection. Okay, I was so confused. I think this is a brand collaboration, Aloha Collection. I was like, weren't we in Italy? We're like, what am I looking at? Okay, okay, Aloha Collection. This is nice. And this here, I'm gonna figure out the price in it. Oh, there it is, $54, such a cute fanny pack. It's like these bags and they're like kind of like crinkly, if you know what I mean. Do you, do you see that? It looks like paper. They're like crinkly. It feels like paper. It feels like paper. So a wonderful employee of the store let us know that this is a material called Tyvek, which they use to insulate the inside of homes. And it's very water resistant and perfect, you know, for the beach, for the pool. Mr. Emil and I are here for the mugs. Look at this. Look at this precious beauty and her painting. I love this mug and it's a stackable mug. Oh, look at the inside design. How much are these mugs? $25, but wait, they also have the one with Minnie and Mickey Mouse. Look at this, look at this, them writing in Venice. How romantic. The gondola. Oh, yes, yeah, so beautiful. Oh, what does it say there? Vacay all day, Minnie and Mickey. We went ahead and opened the tote bag to give a deeper look. Oh my God, look at this one. I hadn't seen this one. Mickey with the camera and then Pluto right next to him. That is adorable. Anyhow, we opened it up and we found the logo of the company, Aloha Collection. Okay, and it says 100% coated Tyvek. Hand wash, hand dry, stow damp items. Okay, keep dry things dry, wet and dry. Interesting. And then it says here, made what we just said, fun, simple, functional, and feels good. Created by surfer flight attendant, Rachel Le Lena Ala, and Kauai native, Heather Ayu. I probably mispronounced that, please. Forgive me, Mr. Emil's laughing at me right now. He is laughing at me. Okay, Aloha Collection Splash Proof Pouches. Keep your dry stuff dry and your wet stuff separate. The tote bag, $84. There is just so much to this collection. I mean, look at that. The linen one with the Minnie Mouse in the background and I can see the sequins and the embroidery it's from here. Sleeve. It's a long sleeve. There's, like I said, lots to this collection. Now it's time for one of our favorite stores here at Disney Springs, Uniqlo. As you probably already know, Uniqlo is a Japanese retailer. They always have new collections. There will be more collections coming out this month, so stay tuned. But for now, let's look at this new collection here. It is for Fujiko Fujio, and it is the 90th anniversary of Fujiko Fujio, which is actually a manga artist duo of two and it says here it was created they created many masterpieces including Doraemon. Doraemon. Is that how you pronounce it Mr. Emma? Yes. Doraemon. Doraemon. Yes and look at them right there how cute. Shirts here at Uniqlo are usually $25 and this is the one we saw on the mannequin with all of the characters and it says 90th anniversary. The funny thing, the front side is actually the back side of Doraemon. This one I love. I don't know how to read Japanese, so if any of my Japanese subscribers can help me and tell me what that says, but look how cute. How many of you have watched Doraemon? Let me know in the comments. And this is the front side. Very cute just so you see how they are commemorating with this collection little logo here, 90th? 
Then there's this blue one with Doraemon up here at the front and the back side, the Fujiko, Fujio, and the back side of the characters. In case you're wondering what the name of the characters are, this t-shirt has them. I see Doraemon and then there's Mami 1977 Doraemon 1970 Fujiko Fujio 1933 Wow Korosuke 1974 Korosuke 1974 Nobita 1970 and Permit number one 1966 Look at all of the collections coming out for April Okay they had a Coco Melon one for kids I am excited about this one 50th anniversary Hello Kitty inspired by the 70s Okay then this one, Chihuahua, Chikawa, and send real characters. It's the popular SNS manga, Chikawa, and send real characters. We love those like little cute kawaii. Oh my god, characters. This is adorable. Peanuts, they love peanuts here. A Lego, and interesting for men. Oh yeah, it tells you here kids, women, this is for girls, this is for women. They have a Zelda so, collection for, for men. Oh, for men, a Disney magic for all forever. Interesting, I wonder what that's gonna be about, but look for me, cause you know me fourth. Star Wars remastered by Kos Kosuke Kawamura. I am I'm struggling a little bit today, Mr. Emo, but we're good. We're, we're making it through. Kosuke Kawamura. Oh, I think Mr. Emo said it better than I did. Hopefully you heard that. But anyhow, <laughs> say it again. Kosuke Kawamura. It's probably that way. Anyhow, and these are the other collaborations. And in case you're wondering, they also have the t-shirts for kids for $15 and Mr. Emo's holding one. Okay, that one they don't have for adults. No. That's really cute. Look at the front side. And these what, are $14. Yeah, they're $14 because they're for kids. In case you didn't know, you can make your own or print your own design which they have a variety of designs to put on tote bags and t-shirts let's check them out like this eeyore print on this canvas tote bag the canvas tote bags are about 30 dollars and then when you open them up it even has a little clip to close it and everything and check this out they also have a print for the fuyuko Fujio, Fujiko, Fujio, okay. 90th anniversary, and look at all the characters down here, so cute. You know, Mr. Emil and I are big Rilakuma fans, and Kiro y Tori, they're having some watermelon. These are the smaller tote bags, $20. These are the machines they use to print on your t-shirt or tote bag. This is where you make your design. So here, somebody chose a Donald Duck. Well, let's see, how about we try? Oh, how cute! Wait, they have many categories. Okay, here we are. And loading. <gasps> okay, nice and large. I like it, I like it. And that's how it look like. So they don't just have Walt Disney Company prints, they also have San X, Peanuts, Snoopy, Marvel, Minecraft, Lauren Martin, Fujiko Fujio, which is what the one we were looking at today. Like, look at this Dore Doraemon one. Doraemon. Doraemon. That one's cute. What else they got? Then I see Boy Kong, Jasper Wong, Steven Othello, Kamawanu, Kamawanu. and Steffi Lin Sai. Okay, okay. And I, the one that I see the most actually is the Walt Disney Company one. Like look at all of these categories. Winnie the Pooh, Pixar, oh my gosh. Look, Pixar Sully. That's know. cute. And yes, you can play graphic designer and paint your own design. That's, uh, that's all right, we'll pretend that looks nice. You can always find cookbooks here. They have the unofficial Naruto cookbook and look at this, Disney princess baking book. And they have for all the prince, well, maybe all the princess, fairy godmother's magic wand, marshmallow crispies, jasmine pistachio hand honey baklava, Rapunzel sundra flower. Oh, what else they got? The Moana heart of defeating pinwheels. 
Oh, pies and tarts. I am going to find Snow White in here. I know it. There's the Percy the Pug's Cherry Streusel Tart, which is for Pocahontas. Belle, be our guest tartlets. Beautiful, the spinning wheel tart. There we go, Snow White's Wishing Well Pie. And this book here is $20. For my pusheen lovers, I'm a big kawaii lover and I recently bought a kawaii coloring book. I feel that if you do activities that fuel your artistic, I guess, or your creative side, it keeps you creative, it really does. And it's also a stress-free activity, okay? Stress-free. Anyhow, this adorable little coloring book is $13. They have another one here for $15. I mean, this is too cute. Funko Pops they have here for Frozen 2. It is Young Anna for $13. You can watch our previous Disney Springs tour right up here or when we visit the Miniso store over in Florida Mall, the cutest store, Disney, and more right down here. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I cannot wait to see you guys again very soon. Bye!